What's up guys? Today I am back playing Pin Builder. I've been really enjoying uh, experimenting with all these features and everything you see on this table uh, is my own doing. I put placed everything where they are. Um, what I tried to do is copy um, and recreate the table called Woe Nelly from Stern. I thought it would be a really good table to try to emulate uh, with this program and game and I'm able to do a lot with it um, you know I colored the pegs my own color the colors of the bumper uh, the bumper uh, skirts underneath and I you know I was playing around with the plastics and the lighting I really love messing around with the lighting I put in the lighting underneath the pegs um, and I was also able to use um, some logic to, and controllers to turn on different things uh, within the game so let me show you real fast because uh, thank thanks to the developer uh, pin builder on their YouTube channel uh, they gave a tutorial on how to do some simple logic so if I press tab now I go to the creator mode editor mode and right here press logic mode on and this is what controls like the lights and the inserts so let's for example click on this controller yeah it's the it controls this so this rollover here once the ball goes over this roller the arrow triggers this bumper this controller which then turns on this pop bumper here this insert here as you can see number two and then this one number three all in one uh, you know one switch and you can see the logic here um, gotta click on this 10 points when it's turned on um, so yeah it's really cool here and everything on this table is my doing and I love it so let's let's uh, let's play it now I did some editing with uh, you know placing stuff and so now let's go to the game part Okay, here we are. T to start. It actually plays pretty good and very similar to Will Nelly. Look at that. See how the pop bumpers lit up? And the inserts. And then another one lit up. See that? That is so cool to me. Just like Will Nelly. Now all four poppers are lit. Giving 10 points, as you can see on the back glass little nudge here they turn off again when the ball drains there you go we turn on an insert we turn on a pop bumper goes back to the plunger lane got a ball gate to stop it from going back from after you plunge it kick out hole kicks out just like the table in Will Nelly in the same direction you can also edit the power of the solenoids. So you like figure out like, okay, maybe, maybe three is too much. Maybe one is not enough, you know? And don't forget that, you know, you can add your own sounds uh, and images on these plastics. I haven't learned that yet. But just imagine what you can do, you know. Let your imagination soar. But I'm really like happy that I'm able to like recreate the very bare bones uh, Will Nelly table. Place just like the one on TPA, pretty much. Maybe even better, honestly. <laughs> like. May not look as good as one on TPA right now, but in terms of like physics, this is better than TPA. And even the scoring is very similar. I haven't mapped, I haven't like done the logic for all like the switches, but I'm happy with the progress I've made so far and especially <clears throat> learning from the developer.
Ooh, that was close. I feel like this really plays like a nice EM. Which is what Will Nelly was kind of trying to do in a way. It's a solid state, but it's a throwback to the EMs. Look at that lighting, the pop bumpers are lit. See, this is like a Wonelli score, 1,100. The uh, it can sense that Wonelli is a real kind of scoring game. It, I think the max is 9,999. Yeah, that would be cool too, to see like, perhaps like reels added and for the back glass and what I'm also hoping that they will add uh, are flashers you know those thick lights those flashers I think that would be really nice to have there you go 1298 well guys thank you for watching me play more pin builder just messing around with all the uh, editing options that are included so far Looking forward to more updates, and uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. Till next time, I'll catch y'all later.